I'm Roy Hattersley. I've been speaking at the festival on the Edwardians. It went, went wonderfully well. A terribly kind audience who uh, were very nice and very appreciative and clapped a lot and asked me interesting questions. I enjoyed this morning immensely. I'm not sure they enjoyed it, but I certainly did. And you're about to do another event? Well, the same subject. Uh, there's a sort of Edwardian day here. So I started it off with this general subject because I wrote a book on called The Edwardians three years ago. And now there's a discussion about very aspects of Edwardian life. I very, very rarely read anything that I should read. If you write a book every two years of a rather serious subject, you spend all the time reading about that. Uh, I've read a lot of 17th century biographies of the Cavendish and Devonshire families, which are immensely boring, uh, but I haven't read very much fiction over the last year. So when you go on holiday, do you uh, take I, a serious book? I off? take the view of Ira Gershwin. Uh, holidays are working somewhere else. Well, the great political book, the great ideological book, is Equality by R. H. Tawney. But the book I recommend for anybody, aspiring politician, aspiring anything, is Arnold Bennett's The Old Wife's Tale. It's one of the great novels of the English language. It's very much ignored, it's very much neglected. And it's not simply about life in Stoke or Burslem or the Potteries in the 1870s. It's about life in general. And anybody who hasn't read and enjoyed and understood The Old Wife's Tale ought to get it out of the library tomorrow.